still remember that when I decided to teach bioethics, uh, most of my colleagues were making joke of me, and this is actually the same situation. Uh, the problem is that bioethics is considered to be an intruder, intruder in uh, other fields of the co in the knowledge. Bioethics uh, as conceived as something uh, related, linked to medical school. But bioethics is uh, the way we judge in a moral, in a moral attitude, every each single aspect, every aspect of our life, of uh, everything is uh, around us in our world and the society we are living in. So um, I developed the interest in this specific field and in web ethics, um, starting from few professional issues uh, I'll be talking about later on, and from one thing I read uh, three years ago, four years ago, in one uh, US newspaper, and the news was uh, uh, a little funny, but also you know a little questioning. And it was funny uh, because the, the, the news uh, was about the big uh, chain market. They were making, as every of this each of, of, of this chain does, uh, a kind of uh, a survey study on consumers to understand what they buy, how they buy it, how they can make uh, better products, how they can. Uh, make a better uh, development of the products and so they found out that when women, when a woman, when women generally speaking became pregnant, they start to buy different stuff. Uh, they want unsample stuff like uh, different soap, different perfume, they don't want perfume actually, they don't want any type of smell because probably the pregnancy uh, is combined with some nausea at the beginning so they don't want sex. And so, when a woman started to change from scented stuff to unscented stuff, they realized that this woman probably was going to be pregnant. It was 100% of the uh, truthness in this. So, uh, one day, uh, since they were used to send cars to those women, telling them, uh, okay, we are very happy about it, about it. we are going to give you some uh, uh, new products, uh, we are going to give you a gift for your baby, you can come over, you can tell us what do you really need and we are going to help you during your pregnancy and even after you deliver your baby. They sent the car to this family and uh, a father got it and uh, the card was about his own daughter and the daughter was a 16 years old teenager. So the father became very upset uh, because uh, he didn't know anything about uh, and he assumed that it was a false, that there was nothing uh, real, there was something really wrong. So he went to talk to the market general director and told him, why you need it? I mean, my little daughter is a very nice lady, she will never do it and also she will tell me, so why you send me this card? This is not true, so you make a very big mistake, and I confess that very mistake. And when the lady, when the young lady, when the daughter came home in the evening, uh, he looked at her and said, You know, something very funny, very fancy happened today, and they was so, so uh, bad about uh, because I don't understand why they did it, why they, are going, they were going to be so fancy to you and to our family. But the young lady, his daughter, looked at him and said, Well, Dad, I didn't know how to tell you, but I'm really pregnant. So the case was, uh, as a father, to be aware that his own daughter is pregnant just because a supermarket sent a car to his home or you know, is just an intrusion in, on his privacy. So the privacy issue is one of the, the big issue of the web and this is not only the issue that is the main issue but it's not only the issue I will be talking inside the course uh, because the web is considered to be neutral. We are using the web, we are using many objects. Each of us has a smartphone, we have uh, iPads, we have computers, we go through the web in many ways and we consider the web something like we are using. 
we don't consider we are something that is using us. So we think uh, about us, ourselves uh, as a consumers, as the owner of the web, because we decide what to do with it. But this is not true. Actually, the web is using us most of the time. The web is using us as uh, products and we are not aware of it. So we need to talk about it because sometimes it is not uh, against the moral, it is not against the law, it is not illegal, it is not uh, unethical, but uh, even so we need to be aware of what we are doing because it is our life we, which is on the web and it is our life which is visible from every morning who is uh, just jumping on his computer.